those right. 500, 600 yeah. houses? Yeah. Wow. So, and where, where do you build those houses? Right here in Lancaster County. Yeah. Company yeah. still superior walls. Yeah. So, yeah, we put foundations in uh, for houses. Right. So if you need a house and you need a foundation or a wall for the basement, instead of cinder blocks, he, he builds a better product called superior walls. Okay. And it lasts longer, doesn't leak, all those other problems. Yeah, much drier. It's insulated. Uh -huh. yeah. So, in Lancaster, it's very famous. Did I can see, I can see. <laughs> not, not many people have a mustache like him. Classic, right? Now, did, you get, did you get his picture? No, I can you get his picture. I can ask him, yeah. Is that okay, Mel? Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Mel is the one who built many, a hundred, about four. To 500 yeah. housing in uh, Lancaster. Okay. So it's so cool building. It'll be on yeah. Haitian television. Uh, so so yeah. it's a construction to be done. With the money that we have in Haiti, that we have in the country, that we have to construct. When uh, there was there is a uh, earthquake, so disaster. So sometimes Haiti, the way they build the house, they right. build the one for the one way. Right. Right. We so we need to have great. Uh, sure. So you could build the wall. We need his uh, ideas. <laughs> <laughs> not, the, the walls, not, the right? walls, not the holes that the Donald Trump is talking about. <laughs> I won't go there. <laughs> clinic in Chapmel. Chapmel? What do we need? What needs to be done? You need a lot of prayer and a lot of money. We, the normal clinic, to build a clinic like that in Chapmel, typically would cost about, you can get a nice clinic for $50,000. Okay. This clinic is a million. Okay, so it would be a lot smaller, but we put the basics. We'd have a nurse, we'd have to pay her salary, and then we'd have uh, clinics. You'd have one main clinic, and then you have small clinics around the outside, smaller ones. So yeah. those are all things we can talk about. Okay. But, uh, so what do we need? What need, what, what need you need someone to be, say, I'm going to be in charge to help raise the money. Okay. So you then see, all the equipment and stuff, we can supply that. Okay. So you can save a lot of money here. Okay. And the food, and we do food too. Okay. And lately, I've been rather than buying the food already processed, like right. they have again, I just give the money to the pastor. Okay. And he goes out in the village and buys their own food. It's own cheaper food. that way. A lot cheaper that mm -hmm. way. And you don't have the hassle of the containers being stuck in port. Right. Because that's yeah, what happens. That's what happens. So we people. don't go through port anymore. We just give the money, let them go buy their own food. Okay. So here we go. Take this box. Makes sense. There you go. Got it? Yep. All right. Oh, here's a couple more. The, these, I didn't tell you this. What's that? 300 bucks each. Wow. 300 bucks each. What are they? $300 each of this. What is these that? More what is that? Stronger inhalers. Okay. 300 bucks. 300, 300, it's 900 right there. When you can't breathe, like people, asthma and stuff like that. Okay. So you take these, oh, you breathe normal. Okay? Big wow. difference. It's the difference between life and death. Right? Wow. All right, good. You're all set. Thank you, Doc.